morning, everybody. Uh, 7.20. Stocks go up, stocks go down, the market reversed. So now what do you need? You need to get the 39.52 today. If you don't, then we see, then we see, then we see. Okay? Uh, today, you got the Chips Act. If, the, if ASML caves, I mean, it's down seven, not bad. But if this thing goes all the way back down to 470, that's telling you all the chips are shit again. Okay? Uh, so interesting, interesting, interesting. So just keep an eye on it. Then, then we see, then we see, then we see. Okay, land research. I mean, think about this. If you bought, and let's talk a little bit about Paris trading. We've been doing this a lot because that's the market you're in. You don't know if you go up or down, up or down, up or down. You got to Paris trade. So you buy ASML and you buy the 520s. You know, we told you the 520s. And they were like 170 to 220, okay, to 220. So you go buy those and say you buy them at 270, right? You buy them at 270. Uh, and you, you bought the lab research at two bucks. The lab research is still 50 cents. So, so you can say you're down a buck and a half on those. On the ASML, they've got to five, almost six bucks yesterday. So you sell them at 550. Okay? So you're up three bucks. Plus the 50 cents, you're up 350. You can sell both sides, you're up 350. Net, net, you're up 350. This is trading. If you buy SPXs, like we bought SPX, what, 38, 30s yesterday. Seven bucks. I mean, uh, two, 270. And we actually sold those for 60 cents, cause, so you only lost two bucks on those. But then you bought the 39, 30s, and they actually went to 16. They went to 16. Now we took, you know, our, our profit, paid for the other ones, and uh, you'd net net positive. You're net net positive. The goal is to be positive. The goal is not to do 20 trades and be up on all 20 trades. That's just stupidity. Okay? Now, one other comment here, because uh, one of these, these dumbasses said this shit on uh, Twitter. Well, Sam gives you trades, and we don't know which ones to take. You don't know which ones to take. We give you information. But here's what the silly people do. If you buy NVIDIA, you don't buy Avago. If you buy Avago, you don't buy Lamb Research. They're in the same industry, unless you're doing a pair trade. You wouldn't do that. Because if you do that, you're getting, two things can go bad. Really, really. If you're, if you're buying Tesla, you're, you're not buying another tech in the same type of industry. You're not buying batteries. If you buy MicroStrategy, you're not buying Mara. Same industry. Okay? Different industries. Got to go different industries. And you have to see. And trading with $500 is different than trading with $1,000. It's different than trading with $10,000. When you call your friend and ask him what to do, that tells me you don't understand the market. Why do you think your friend understands the market? You're going to do what he does? It doesn't make any sense. Do things that make sense. You will get better. You will get better. If they start taking land research down here, and it looks like they're going to, and this thing pops 430, let me tell you, if land research takes out 430, and ASML goes lower, and then all of a sudden Tesla misses, LAM research could go to 380 tomorrow. So now you would have hit the uh, ASML up and the uh, LAM research down. The news is that bad from ASML, okay? Doesn't mean it goes down. Maybe they take it, take it up for a day or two. But just understand the other piece that I told you earlier. If they take the market way up into Powell, he can do and say whatever he wants to say. And just, he's happy. The market's up, right? Not rocket science. Okay, SPX, very straightforward. 39.52, 39.72. 
Then we see then we see Powell next week at the Fed meeting. Okay? Downside under thirty nine hundred. Bad, bad, bad. NVIDIA. One seventy two, one seventy six underneath one forty nine, way down there. ASML. See if this pops and drops. The new they made good money. But their comments are shit. This is like it's it, it's just shit. It doesn't make any sense to me. How do you miss guy down by a billion dollars? Not not fifty million, a hundred million, or three hundred million, or or currency by a billion dollars. A billion dollars. Think about it. Micron went from nine billion to six billion. Six billion. They lost two and a half billion dollars. Jesus. That's why if you go look at Micron and you pull up the charts. The Micron charts, not for me, but go pull them up for 2000, 2001, 2002. This stock would go from 50 to 5. It'd go to 5. The business went to shit. Okay? Uh, Avago. Tried to break up, needs this chip back. If it get to 516, it can run. Then we see Apple still going higher. This makes no sense, but that bodes well for the market. Then we see. Pan W voted best place to work. I don't think anybody cares. 523, 526, uh, very hard underneath 481. Boeing, I don't know about this 200 jet order, uh, but we have to go look at it and figure it out. But if it's real, Boeing should be up $8, at least 163, and it's not. So it's kind of interesting to see. MDB can't seem to get back to 300. It's going slow. UNH, 533, 539. Uh, Netflix, 217, maybe very hard, and then back lower. Uh, Snowman can't seem to get going, 151. NOW, uh, those options, 400, were $3 from 160. And now they're a dollar. Got to trade them up, got to trade them down, and decide to hold them. Tesla. If they run this to 5770, then I would say they know that it's going to be good. If they take it way lower, then nobody nobody's interested. Goldman Sachs, 321, 309. MicroStrategy, can crypto Bitcoin get to 25K? If it does, MicroStrategy can pop to 300. That's what we know. That's what we know. Macro is planning to reopen. Most not commercial industries and commercial companies, including casino venue for a limited time. Oh, Macau, sorry. Uh, from midnight. Interesting. Uh, Paul is next week. Rebecca saying, I'm in my virtual world right now. Very nice. With my Sam avatar. Okay. Very nice. Okay. Uh, after the close, Carnival, EFX, Tesla. And that's what we know. Everybody have a great day. See you in chat.